Hello guys and welcome to DTWG, the prep welcome. Okay, so in today's video, I'm going to be um, um, telling you how you can pass your GED fast in year 2022. And these are some questions, you know, um, and I got these questions from our Facebook group. These are questions that are always bothering on the people's mind on how to get their GED fast. Are you getting my point? So after I answer these questions, then I'll take you to the GED.com website to show you several resources that you can use to study and get your GED fast. All right. So um, so now let's answer this question. Before we do, please, please try to please subscribe to our YouTube channel. OK, to support us to grow. And also you can check our websites uh, for summary notes. I'm going to be showing you that, too. OK, for summary notes, study guides, practice. Um, practice question this is website dtwgedprep.com and you can also um you know we have a facebook group we are right now i think six thousand plus so please do join the group so you you know you receive a lot of support to help you get your ged fast in 2022 so now let's answer these questions now the first one is can i do my ged without registering for classes Yes, you can do your GED without registering for classes. Okay, and I'm going to show you exactly how you can do that when we get to the GED.com uh, website. Okay, so you can do it. That's the first question. You know, I know you must have heard, oh, I need to go to classes before. I know you can do it without registering for classes. Okay, it's not a must you go for classes. You can do it without registering for classes. You can read and study on your own and take the practice test online or offline okay so the next question is what are the best books to study with okay i would leave the link of um several books okay there are three books from my um experience in tutoring a students there are three books i would recommend for you to use you can pick any one of them you can use um, Pristine, uh, Pristine review. You can use um, Steck. That's what uh, Steck. Uh, I can't really pronounce that. that name. Steck von Hall. It's by Paxton Publishers. All the links are. I'm gonna leave the links to get those books. Please support me by using the, those links to get those books on Amazon. And you can also use Kaplan. All right. Why I would say Kaplan is if, uh, for instance, you are having difficulty with maths, Kaplan has has a lot of practice questions okay that you can use to study in-depthly all right but uh, for the pristine review it's more of the exact styled ged question but they don't really have much questions like the kaplan much practice questions like the kaplan okay the kaplan really helps you to build um, a solid maths foundation all right but your pristine and um, step for hot they are really really ged style questions okay so if you have problems with maths if you can afford the kaplan and also a pristine or a kaplan and a stack uh, von hog by paxton publishers that will be fine and most importantly please try to get your ged calculator and learn because in each of those books there are also tutorials to teach you on how to use the GED calculator. And also on, the ch on my channel, there are some videos also to teach you on how to use the GED calculator. It's going to help you very, very well in your maths. Okay, help you with speed and also help you with accuracy. Okay, and uh, I'm also going to leave. I'm also going to leave the link to get also your GED calculator. Quite important. So please support me by using um, those um, links to get your resources on amazon all right now the third question is what should i read what guide what should i uh, study for my social studies for the science for maths for your rla what should i study i'm going to leave links also to guides it's on the dtwgedprep.com uh, website but the direct link to those guides on those several um the, the each subject i'm also going to leave the link there for you to read okay then the fourth question is, what is the best site to take practice tests? The best sites to take practice tests is GED.com because they will give you the exact styled 
uh, questions that you are going to expect in your main uh, final test. Okay, so the best best site to, to use is what your gd.com and uh, I think it's 66, uh, sorry, six dollars each for each um, each test. And there's I think there's a discount code that you can use to get it cheaper. It's uh, 50, is it 50 off? I'm also going to leave the details in the description box okay of this video to check so you get a discount of the practice test so you take it as many times as you can afford it's going to help you in passing your gd test okay i always recommend i always tell students okay that please please students i tutor i also do one-on-one -on -one tutoring if you're having your problems with maths you can contact me and i do some group tutoring like two weeks 10 days math clinic um some months that's when I'm quite chance. But if you're on the Facebook group, you will always get notified of when I, I would do like the group tutorial for 10 days at a very cheap amount. Okay. So I would leave the link there. And I also advise them, please do take the practice test for it's going to help you prepare. Okay. Because immediately you take each practice test, um, there's a summary, there's a review of your results and where you have to study more. So this would help you know where to study more. Okay, that's why this practice, taking a practice test on your GED.com will really, really go a long way to help you in passing and getting your GED fast. Now, the final question is, what is the difference between the online and center testing? Okay, the big difference between the online and center testing is that the online, right now, you can just go to the GED.com site and register and do your, your test okay that's after you must have you well, before you do uh, before you do the test you take a GED ready test when you get scores above one of uh, 145 and above then you are allowed to book for a test okay but for the center testing you have to schedule a time to take the test for the center testing you can take in your fix physical calculator and you'll be allowed with a sheet a white sheet and a pencil to you know um work do your workings on it but for the online test you have to use the online calculator and an online worksheet so it depends on you if you're quite digital savvy savvy i'll say okay go for the online testing but if you're not you're not comfortable with you know the online how to use the whiteboard you don't know all those i would I advise you do uh, a physical center testing okay so that's just the major difference between the online and center testing it depends on you how digital savvy you are okay but it's still the same timing all right so for the center testing you can take in your physical calculator you're given a white sheet of paper to use for your rough work while the online you are you you use an online calculator and also an online worksheet or whiteboard okay to do your rough work all right so these are the questions now now let's go to the um the ged site okay yeah so this is the G the ged site ged.com so what you do is you sign up free to sign up okay sometimes you, you don't that's why i said you don't need to go to maybe an adult education center go there to if you want to get your ged fast just come here to ged.com you sign up in whichever state you are all right sign up and that's in the us okay sign up here I'm just going to log in. I'm already uh, registered. I'm just going to log in here. So I show you. Uh, yeah, so I show you uh, how to go about it. Okay. And even before, even if you don't want to, if you just want to browse around the site without, uh, you know, registering, you can still do that. Like you can go here. All right, when you get to study, if you want to register for their online classes or a physical class, it depends on their centers around you in which, which state you are. Okay, you can do that. So, and if you want to practice, this is uh, your test preview. This is like a sample uh, test. This is for maths. This is for your language arts. This is social studies, your science. You can see you can do a lot without even signing up all for free okay these are resources that will help you okay and um this sample test you just have like 10 10 questions here except, except. 
okay you have like 10 questions here after 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 just solving them you can see answer explanation it explains it for you okay for each of uh, for each of the subjects so these are resources you can use your calculator also calculator reference how to use the calculator here it's can you see this so it's you you use this to what you use this to practice okay it's not operational cost okay all right so you can use this to read and practice quickly all right you have maybe after work you have like one hour you can focus on maths okay i always advise some um, students to first of all start with the ones you are quite familiar with the, the subjects don't start with difficult ones so you don't get discouraged start with if you're good in your rla start with rla trash it out you know pass it then go to social studies Treat the ones that are difficult. The subject, if math is your like your, you you know you you're not that strong in math, then that should be the final one. Okay. So when you finish taking the the practice test and you see where you need to improve on, what you need to do now is to study with your textbooks. All right. Study with the textbooks you've gotten because it's quite important for you to get a textbook. In any school, in any educational effort you want to embark in, you need textbooks. And I always prefer students not to go for PDF, all right, because it might not really help you focus. Get a, a notebook and a textbook and write, okay? It helps your memory when you use pen and paper to write and you read from a textbook to study. It helps and improve your memory, okay? So please don't just focus on only videos. I'm not saying videos are not helpful. They are helpful, but when you watch videos, go into your textbook, um, that particular topic, let's say it's algebra or polynomials, go there and try to solve questions on those things and practice. Are you getting me? So putting your pen on paper and practice and practice, and that would help you out in passing your GED fast. Okay, so these are sample questions you can try out. All right, you're good in language arts. Quickly go here, try the sample questions and see how you go through it. And when you do that, go do your um, the GED practice test. You can come here. All right. You can come here. Uh, and what after you do your GED practice test, you just schedule your tests. That's all. Are you getting my point? You schedule your test uh, for your study. All right. Let's say okay. Let me let me just go with maths. You click on maths. It shows you, okay, everything you need to study here. Are you seeing this? Intro to maths, ten basic skills, geometry. Everything you need to study, it shows you here. So all you need to do is go in and read. It gives you an example of the kind of questions that you would what you would expect. Okay, in in fractions, it gives you. You just click on next, next. You see what uh, you you uh, you see questions that would likely come out. Okay, then hold on. All right. Then when you want to, when you're done reading this, you schedule for your GED ready practice test. And when you do that, if you score above uh, 145, all right, you can see this is 6.99. I'm going to give you um, the, the discount code. All right. I'm going to drop that in the video description box of this video. If you like any of these resources, you can get them. They are also quite good. But if you don't have money for it, fine. Just get a good textbook. I've told you the textbooks, textbooks too that you can use. All right. So do that. All right. So you can see this. Buy all four subjects at once. And you do, this, you do the practice, the GED ready practice test. You get above 145 or 145. And you're good. Okay. You're good to now schedule for your main test. So this is what you do. Let me go back, okay? So this is what you do, all right? Are you seeing this? The topics to focus on your basic math, geometry, basic algebra, and graphs and functions. I would say um, if you're good with your basic maths, okay, don't really focus much on it. Focus more on your geometry, your basic algebra, quite important, graphs and functions, also quite important. I've done a video on how to pass your GED maths. That is quite uh, focused. Focus on each subject. Okay, I'll leave those links there if you want to go through those videos. So this is what you do. 
All right. So these are the free math practice questions to do. You know, you get all this when you have signed in. Okay, when you sign up, free to sign up. When you click the sign up page, it asks you for your details. Free, free to sign up. Okay. All right. And when you get in there, you know, this is all your profile. This is everything. When you do your test, it also sh um, shows you your scores and all that. You schedule your test here if it's the online or offline. So you don't really need to go through a center. You can do this on your laptop. Are you getting my point? All right. At home, you can do it from home. All right. So this is how you can get your GED fast in year 2022. I just said to do this video to help because several, several questions on the Facebook group on, can I get my GED without classes? What can I do to get this GED fast? I need to get it for a job, you know, I know, I know, I know. All right. So this is what you can do to get your GED fast this year. So you can see this when you come here, click on math. You can also click on, when you click on science, it takes you to the science page, you know, you read, you go through the details, what the study guide thinks you are to, um, that would come out in the science test. When you're ready, you take the GED practice, you know, just use like one hour, one hour, you should be able to go through all this, do the free science practice questions. Then you can schedule for the GED practice test. Okay, so this is how I don't want this video to be quite long, but this is how you can get your GED fast in year 2022. As I said, please, it's important for you to get a textbook and get your notebook. It helps you, all right, to study better. Pen on paper to practice. And uh, for uh, if you're having problems, uh, just one more thing to add. If you're having problems um, in reading and comprehension, this is a very good site to help you. Readtheory.com. I'm going to leave all those links there, but I just want to show you this. So just sign up. It's free. All right. It helps with your vocabulary, comprehension, understanding, um, you know, passages and trying to get the main idea out of those passages. Okay. It helps you with your social studies. It helps you with your RLA. That's for, you know, if you, 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 you're not like a non-English speaking uh, immigrant, okay. You're still struggling with your English and all that. Okay. This would help you. All right. This would help you. And there are several videos. If you're having problems in your math, several videos on my channel that would help you. There's this, let me show you this. Sorry. I'm taking your time. I apologize. All right, so aha, this video is quite, quite good for you. Having problems with your math, 30 most difficult GD math questions solved would help you. Okay, all right, then let me show you playlists that would also help you. There's a playlist on you having problems with quadratic equation. There's a playlist here. Having, see, the GED playlist, GED calculator I told you about. Having problems with inequality, this is it. Probability, everything on probability is here. Um, this is also uh, most difficult, like a playlist of most difficult GED questions solved. All right. Having problems with slope, this is a playlist. Having problems with your algebra, polynomials and all, this is another playlist. Okay, so all these playlists would help you. And also subscribing to this channel so you are instantly notified because there will be several videos that will be coming up throughout the year that will support you with getting your GED fast. All right? And try to be on the Facebook group as we would also interact, you know, constantly. All right, on the Facebook group. All right, so thank you, thank you for staying tuned to DTW to uh, DTW GED Prep, and see you in our next video. Bye. Oh, and I also forgot. Please, please, if you, um, if you haven't given your life to Christ yet, He is waiting for you. Okay, for Jesus Christ is coming soon. Please, please give your life to Christ, for He is the way. He is the truth and he is the life. And he's the one who's going to lead us to heaven at last. Give us that life of peace, of health, okay, of joy. Okay, so thank you and see you in our next video. Bye.